I haven't done one of these in a while. Um, I might be a little awkward, but you know, I tried out the whole live streaming thing and frankly, I don't really think it's for me. I like this, you know, recorded style of pre-record and then edit it a little bit and then post. I feel like that way we can get everything in order, do everything all in once and we get like a good grasp um, of everything. But uh, I just wanted to update you guys on everything that's been going on with both the channel, the startup and the future of what we're trying to build. I can't lie, I've been a little down lately because results haven't been where they should be. Like, you know, I've been getting some good money from the channel and some coaching here and there. Like I made 250, you could say, US dollars. And I'm not complaining. That's not bad money and I'm quite happy with where we are. But I really want the startup once we release it to be you know, well put together, really, you know, do well, you know, I, I, again, I say it's not about money, but I'd like to see some results for my efforts. And even, even on the YouTube channel, we've had a pretty bad week. I think that's the main thing I wanted to talk about, you know, right now, a lot of people have clicked off and that's fine. Failure should be there. It should be there. Um, it's really hard to see right now because I, I really want to fucking see results. You know, we all want to see results. We all want that really nice body. We want the most money. We want the rewards. But what we often fucking forget, right, is that we have to endure the bad times and overcome these situations in order to reap the, the benefits of what we want. And frankly, man, you know, I'm not into the hoodoo voodoo shit, if that makes sense. But I believe that these challenges are in place. The lack of results, the lack of views on the channel, I think they're there and they're a sign telling us that we should improve, we should change something and mess around with some things now i've been trying a special type of special type of videos where you know i'm highly editing it i'm really fixing up the thumbnails and some of them have been working but then a good few have not worked so i'll have to do some research on that part um i don't know i really don't know what to do uh it's it's been quite difficult for both my ego very humbling and just for myself in general. But, you know, we have to be grateful for what we have, keep pushing forward and working towards what we want. And I plan to document as much as possible for you guys, post it on the channel and build something together. Now, the platform as promised will be a course platform that I will be posting stuff on so that, that you know, people could buy. And uh, we'll see how that goes. You know, uh, we're, we're, we're almost done it. I have I have a decent amount left to do, but, you know, we're testing things out. We're doing stuff. We're tinkering here and there. Um, it's it's coming well. You know, the the app is we've been coding it for a while, but I'll show you in a second how it looks and we'll go through everything and what we plan to do. So it'll be super exciting. But even ahead of that, I think the next sort of chapter would be to expand outside of just this platform because what I've realized with both YouTube and the course we're building, the, the platform that we're building right now, if I'm gonna post courses, I'm gonna have to learn a lot of things, right? So let's say I wanna make like a C course. I'm gonna have to learn C and then make content about it through a course, right? I would like to at least expand my knowledge maybe into some aspect and I don't know when this video is coming out, maybe you guys are the first one to hear this, but I'm thinking of, well, I'm highly considering um, switching not switching but learning a bit of c and robotics you know something cool where we could do something in the real world and document that i don't know but my main idea is to you know learn something make content about it and then sell the the course or like the document uh, so that people can also learn and uh, ingest the knowledge from what i have learned so let's say i learned c I learned, you know, some sort of robotics thing. I make like a simple course on how to build something and people can know how to do that because we went through it ourselves. So I don't know, that would be pretty cool to do. I'm already doing that on YouTube for free. So we'd have to include more additional things, maybe like notion templates, talks, stuff like that, or, you know, additional stuff to make it enticing. But I think that's sort of the, the way I want it to go. Now, in terms of the content, I don't know what we could do to make it better, 
change it up a bit. I don't know if this casual sort of conversation works versus like the highly edited stuff. I'm still trying to find my space even a couple months in. Um, but frankly, man, that's it. I don't, I don't know. It's unknown. And I think that's the value of entrepreneurship and, and, and coding. You just have to fucking explore and kind of figure out where you are in the space. But as promised, we're going to head over to the code. Hopefully you can see and we're going to run our application and let's just open that up. And as you can see, if you have not been a part of the live content, the thing looks a lot different. You can tell, right? You know, we added this cool little features here, added some things right here. We have the courses page with some cool search functionalities. Um, and within here, right, when the user, let's say wants to go to the JavaScript course, they can head over there and they are led to a simple course display page. Now under each uh, course, they have a video and everything is displayed. So if I head back, actually, we can actually solve this problem. Um, don't mind the animations. Um, over here is the main uh, video that works right now because I only uploaded one video and it's gonna load so it might take some time. Um, however, the UI sucks, okay? Disregard the UI. But the main idea right now is that we have a working sidebar so that the users can go through each chapter of the course. A video display that works, it works, I promise me. And uh, we have a way, we have a way to uh, check the courses that we made. So I made an admin, oops, admin page where we can check and change the everything there is with the course. So let's say we have the JavaScript course over here. It's completely functional with the back end. So we can just press the edit and we can basically edit everything that we want. So, you know, maybe it's a video from the uh, from the chapter. So we can like remove the chapter and then add a video. So here we can actually do this live. Well, not really live, but you know what I mean. So say we have this, uh, I don't know, 14 minute, let's say it's this video of me, like some B-roll, right? I'll upload it like this and uh, hopefully it should work. Okay, so that didn't work. Trust me, trust me, it works, it works. Um, so let's say we wanna add a chapter. So I don't know, 3D, whatever, okay? It works, chapter created. It's a draft, so we can uh, add a description, so Hey, video where we upload the video as promised. So let's take this one right here and hopefully it should work once we upload it. I think it's because we, we messed with some things before. So there we go, chapter updated. And I believe if we refresh the page, the video, the live stream or video are not yet ready. Videos can take a few. Okay, so I think if we just publish it now, actually we need to make it free first and then publish it. Now, I don't know how long this will take for us, but luckily it's only us, there we go. So we have the video here, and if we head back to our main page and go to the courses, hopefully the JavaScript code, yeah, we have three chapters. I am <laughs> in deep water. So if we head over to the 3D page right here, there we go. So everything seems to work, and you can see like once we're uploaded, so here's where we can display the actual courses and um, or like the chapters so that they can go through each and then complete all of them. But, you know, man, um, it's been very difficult and I don't know, I haven't really talked about it, but it's been a while since I've done this. So I apologize for that. We're, we're doing fine. We're doing good. Uh, I just wanted to document everything. You know, we have the video uploader. We have authentication, obviously working for a long, long time. Uh, we have user ID, payment history, and stuff like that. We actually haven't done these yet, but we will. We have the courses. Hopefully the roadmap works. Like, I don't know why it wasn't working earlier. Okay, it works. There we go. And we have like difficulty levels, which is cool. And, um, you know, everything's really coming together. So I hope, I hope in the future are able to expand into different fields, make videos on YouTube, because I love doing this, talking about stuff and uh, hopefully make money obviously off of YouTube while also uh, making money by teaching people in a more specific manner. So maybe we make like a course on C or animations and then we 
we sell it as this thing that people can you know uh, can buy. However, uh, we're good. You know, I'm 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 not happy with the results, but I'm also pretty grateful for where we are and where we stand right now. But uh, anyways, uh, I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you guys like this style of content. Uh, I don't really know what we're gonna do. You know, there's a lot of things we need to change with the channel because the views are very down. And frankly, I haven't really been myself. I've been trying different things from different popular people. And I've just been tinkering with a couple of things just to see if people will like it. And I don't really think it's worked as well as I thought it should. So I'll see how that goes. I'll see what I need to do. Maybe we not edit any videos or we edit more or we change some things up. But I think that's the nature of business and everything. And um, I hope that you guys can come along with me for the ride. All right. But uh, yeah, I'm going to end the video here again. Thank you so much for sticking around those who are. And I love you all. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.